Brass Video Tutorial. You start the game in Canal Period having £30 and no victory points. In the first round, you only have one action. The goal of the game is to earn victory points by building and activating industries. The simplest strategy is to build a cotton mill and ship its cotton to port. Here are action cards. Everything you do in the game costs you an action card. Let's start. Select Build. The game highlights places where you can build. Select a slot with a cotton icon that is close to port. You can build a cotton mill for £12. When activated it will give you 5 income points and 3 victory points. In order to build you have to discard a valid card. Either the industry card that matches the industry you are building or location card matching the location you are building in. Strategy in this game is formed through card play decisions. You want to keep the cards for which you see future use and discard those which rather block your hand than offer opportunities. Next, confirm the action. A cotton mill has been built. Your turn ends with your cards resupplied. Now your opponent will play. You can watch the animations or skip them. The second turn begins. Player order in turn is opposite to the amount of money spent in the previous turn. In order to sell cotton, you need to have a cotton mill connected to a port via canals. Let's build a port. Select the slot with a port symbol in Lancaster. Build a port for six pounds, which will give you three income points and two victory points. Confirm the action. A port has been built. In your second action, Build a canal between Preston and Lancaster. It will allow you to sell cotton from a cotton mill to a port. In order to build a canal, you have to discard any card. Select a slot where you want to build a canal. The canal will give you the amount of victory points equal to the number of activated industries connected to this canal. Build a canal for £3. Confirm the action. Once the canal has been built, your turn ends with your cards resupplied. The third turn begins. Finally, we are ready to sell the cotton. Discard any card. Select a cotton mill from which you want to sell the cotton. Select the port to which you want to sell the cotton. You can sell the cotton to port or for export. Selling for export does not require a port but may bring lower income. Therefore, sell the cotton to the port. Confirm the action. Once the cotton has been transported to port, both the port and cotton mill have been active giving you income points and victory points. You also earned two victory points for a canal which links two activated industries. You've built your first industries, earned your first money and victory points. Congratulations. In order to develop further, you will need bigger capital. You can gain this by taking loans. You do not have to repair the loans. Instead, they lower your income, which represents the cost of the capital. You can also develop your industries so they are worth more income points and victory points when you activate them. This game offers many ways to earn money and victory points, and we've showed you the easiest ones. As you can see, you can build coal mines, ironworks and shipyards. Your profit from the coal mines and ironworks by using all these resources they produce, and this will activate them. You can use these resources to build and develop industries and railways. Shipyards activate immediately after being built, giving you large amounts of victory points. However, you need to invest them by using Develop Action. Now you're ready for the game of brass. If you want to learn the full game rules, visit the help and tutorials section and use the interactive tutorials located over the game rules section. Good luck. Thank you.